All right, so I have this string, and what I'm going to do, this is an umbilical vessel. I'm not going to tell you which one it is. I want you to find out. So this is it. You can see this blood vessel right here. And I'm going to take the string. See, I'm using my tweezers, and I'm going to tie a knot, just a little loop. I'm going to tie that like that. And then I'm going to go, this is, a, this is a structure, this is your liver, well it's your, it's your pig's liver, and I'm going to, so this blood vessel is going into the liver, and I'm going to tie this knot here. Clumpy fingers are not cooperating. Come on, get through there. Or maybe it's the twine. Hopefully, I'll have a different twine for you that won't be so stringy. And the only reason we're doing this is so we can keep track of that. Otherwise, we're going to cut between there. We're going to cut between these knots. So now I put a knot there and a knot there. I take my scissors. Get rid of that extra string a little bit. I don't need that. That's just too much stuff. And then I'm going to cut between them, and that's going to allow us to that's going to allow us to uh, continue our incisions uh, and move things around. Okay. So here's my incision. I'm going to keep going back. Next direction. I'm going to go. I'm going to go anterior to his hind limb. Okay, now I've got this flap. See that? So I'm gonna do that on both sides. Now you can start to see some stuff. Inside is, and this, this is a he, so it's his abdominal cavity. Okay. So keep those, keep those structures there. We'll fold those up and that will help keep the pig um, moist. I know you don't, some of you don't like that word, too bad, so sad.